Everything about Australia is unique and you won't see anything more unique than the Northern Territory. Every single community is different, every single story is different. It is the home of Indigenous art in this country and we want the world to know. The Darwin Aboriginal Art Fair Foundation exists to support and promote uh, Indigenous art centres from around the country. There's a real appetite for that engagement and we really provide that for Australia's First Nations. So because of the COVID outbreak, we were forced to really look at our program and the way we delivered our service. We reached out to each and every art centre and the resounding message that we heard was, you need to help us make sales. For us, it was really just a time to take a leap of faith and embrace the digital space. So we came up with an amazing platform that allowed people from all across the world to be able to interact directly with our artists, all from the comfort of their own homes. We were quite blown away with the success of DAF this year. The workshops and artist talks, tickets were sold within the week of release, so that was really exciting to see. Art lovers, culture lovers alike had the opportunity to not only learn about Indigenous cultures but also purchase Indigenous art. And so that reached all corners of the globe. The art sales were 2.6 million and 100% of that returns to communities. So we were absolutely thrilled. And we're now in this space that is really hard to ignore. I'm really proud of the 69 art centres that trusted us to be able to build this space. It makes me a bit teary, you know, like it's a pretty big, it was a pretty big deal. COVID pandemic or not, they're the ones on the ground supporting cultural preservation and to be able to still tell their stories after what has been an incredible year shows the resilience that we'll just keep on surviving as we go through the ages.